In the heart of every great city lies a silent marvel, a testament to human ingenuity hidden beneath the waves. Today we're re-diving into the depths of a fascinating topic that many have pondered but few truly understand. How is concrete built underwater? You might think it's just concrete, after all, but you'd be wrong. As you watch this video, get ready to uncover the secrets behind the creation of underwater concrete, a process that defies the very nature of gravity and the challenges posed by one of the toughest elements, water itself. When it comes to building structures underwater, there's a lot more going on beneath the surface than meets the eye. Unlike traditional concrete work on land, pouring concrete underwater is a delicate dance with water pressure and buoyancy, demanding specialized techniques and innovative solutions. Let's take a closer look at the unseen challenge of underwater concrete construction. One of the biggest hurdles in underwater concrete construction is the immense water pressure. As you dive deeper below the water's surface, the weight of the water above exerts a tremendous pressure that can reach several atmospheres. This pressure doesn't just make working underwater tough, it also significantly affects the behavior of concrete. The strength of concrete is often compromised when subjected to high water pressures, making it more difficult to work with and potentially leading to structural issues. To counter this, engineers use specialized equipment and techniques to manage the pressure and ensure the safety of workers. They may employ devices such as ballast tanks or inflatable collars to maintain stability and control the buoyancy of structures. Speaking of buoyancy, have you ever wondered how concrete stays submerged and doesn't flow to the surface? Well, the answer lies in the science of density. Concrete typically has a higher density than water, which helps keep it submerged. However, underwater construction requires extra measures to ensure that the concrete mixture is dense enough to resist buoyancy. By using heavier aggregates and engineers can create a concrete mix that is more resistant to the upward force of water. These admixtures can include mineral or silica, fume or fly ash, which not only increase the density of the concrete, but also enhance its strengths and durability. Proper curing is another critical factor in underwater concrete construction. Unlike concrete poured on land, underwater concrete is constantly exposed to the movement of water and the potential for corrosion. To ensure optimal hardening and longevity, it's essential to protect the concrete from these elements. This can be achieved by using co which are temporary walls or enclosures that isolate the construction area from the surrounding water. Cofferdams allow for a more controlled environment, ensuring that the concrete cures properly without disturbance. They also help maintain the water level below the construction area, preventing the concrete from being washed away or damaged. Various types of cofferdams are used in underwater construction including sheet pile walls, which are formed by interlocking steel sheets driven into the seabed, and inflatable cofferdams, which are constructed using inflatable tubes filled with water or air. Now let's talk about the actual pouring of concrete. Underwater pouring is a delicate operation that requires precision and care. One common method used in underwater concrete construction is the tremie pipe. This technique involves pouring the concrete mixture into a long pipe, which is then lowered into the water. The pipe also known as a tremi, is filled with concrete and allowed to flow out of a bottom opening. This controlled flow ensures that the concrete is deposited accurately and minimizes the chances of segregation or washing away. Another method is the use of underwater pumps, which are specifically designed to pump concrete through pipelines beneath the water's surface. These pumps are capable of delivering concrete at a consistent rate, making it easier to place the concrete in the desired location. The underwater construction of bridges is a prime example of the application of these techniques. Iconic structures like the Chesapeake Bay Bridge and the Verrazanaros Bridge have incorporated underwater concrete segments to support their foundations or create submerged roadways. Underwater tunnels are another impressive feat of concrete engineering, allowing for the transportation of people or goods beneath a body of water. The Channel Tunnel and the Holland Tunnel are renowned for their groundbreaking underwater concrete work, demonstrating the strength and durability of this material in extreme environments. Marine infrastructure such as docks, piers and breakwaters rely heavily on underwater concrete to withstand the forces of waves and currents. These structures play a crucial role in maritime transportation and coastal protection. The world of underwater concrete is vast and multifaceted, encompassing everything from marine construction to offshore wind farms, underwater habitats and more. 
With advancements in technology and the growing demand for innovative construction methods, the future of underwater concrete looks promising. New techniques such as underwater 3D, printing and robotic construction are pushing the boundaries of what can be achieved beneath the waves. Additionally, the development of eco-friendly concrete mixtures specifically for underwater applications is paving the way for more sustainable construction practices. If you're fascinated by the underwater world of concrete, there's plenty to explore. Dive into the depths of knowledge by reading online articles, watching documentaries or enrolling in courses offered by universities or professional organizations. So the next time you encounter a structure that seems to defy the odds hidden beneath the water's surface, Take a moment to appreciate the intricate process of underwater concrete construction, from managing water pressure to battling buoyancy. Each step is a testament to human innovation and problem-solving abilities. Whether it's a bridge, a tunnel, or any other underwater marvel, remember that there's a lot more to see beneath the waves. So keep your eyes open, your mind curious, and your spirit of adventure alive because the underwater world of concrete is waiting to be explored. Thanks for joining us on this journey into the depths of a fascinating topic. We hope you found this video informative and entertaining. If you enjoyed learning about the underwater construction of concrete, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button below to show your appreciation. And if you haven't already, subscribe to stay informed about our latest videos.